The messages were hidden thousands of years ago after a volcanic eruption, but now modern technology is helping bring them back to life. I'm Alex Whitney for 3 News Now here at the University of Nebraska Lincoln's campus, where one student, along with the help of some artificial intelligence, has helped shine a light on a long forgotten piece of history. So kind of the background on the project starts 2,000 years ago. For months now, Luke Ferreter has been on a mission to uncover a message that's been lost for almost two millenniums. There was a library next to the city of Pompeii. That library was owned by Julius Caesar's father-in-law, we're pretty sure. And of course, Pompeii happens, the volcano goes off, everything's buried in lava. Found in the rubble of that library were hundreds of papyrus scrolls. The heat from the volcanic ash and debris carbonized the scrolls leaving them deformed but preserved. Now researchers and students from across the country are trying to find out what they say, calling it the Vesuvius Challenge. And they created an online challenge where they said, hey, download the scans here. If you can find writing in them, uh, we'll send you a bunch of money. Discerning the messages left in the scroll started with Dr. Brent Sales at the University of Kentucky using x-ray tomography and computer vision. We start with these CT scans of these scrolls. It's the same CT scan you'll get if you go to the doctor. You start with that scan and then the first thing you need to do is you need to virtually unroll the scroll. So right now it's like a spiral, like a thing of toilet paper. You kind of have to virtually flatten that and like isolate each square of the toilet paper. When virtually unrolled, the text on the scrolls was unable to be read. That was until Luke brought his expertise in artificial intelligence to the project. And you need to use this AI that I've developed to make that text visible and make the ink visible. It took a lot of trial and error, but Luke's artificial intelligence began finding letters in the scroll. First it was just one, then two, then he made the breakthrough discovery that has won him the first prize in the Vesuvius Challenge. And of the ten letters that I found, most of them spell out the word prophorus, which means purple in Greek. Finding the first word earned Luke $40,000 in prize money. But the challenge isn't over yet. Researchers are still offering a reward for the first four paragraphs found within the scroll. And Luke wants to be the one to bring the ancient text back to life. Well, I definitely want to read all the scrolls. Um, that's kind of my, my current priority, and I, you know, I just think that's just such an exciting avenue. So I'll definitely be pursuing that long term. The winner of the grand prize will earn $700,000 in prize money. In Lincoln, Alex Whitney, 3 News Now.